Adjust and tighten. Congratulations, you've got yourself a bow tie. We don't have a bow tie yet. Thank you to everyone who's come here. You know, you sit in a room full of people like this and see how many people came to support you. It, it really does mean a lot and uh, it's, it's pretty special. So I got him some custom cowboy boots. We've had the boots for a little while, so he's been antsy to put them on. I was like, no, you have to wait. Right. 312 16, that's today. <laughs> Yeah. First time I saw Megan, I was a freshman at Ole Miss. Going to the class that first day, I was real nervous. I mean, I didn't know anybody. I didn't know what was going to happen. I said, I'm just going to go walk in, find the hottest girl in that room, sit down by her, see what happens. And by God, almost 12 years later, here we are now. You know what I'm saying? Dear Josh, ever since I was a little girl, I have wondered who my future husband was going to be. I'm so thankful that our friendship came first and that it was a slow road to where we are today. I hope that I can be the wife you have always dreamed of and the one that your parents have prayed for. Having you by my side is what makes my heart filled. Josh, take you, Megan, to be my wife. I, Megan, take you, Josh, to be my husband. You know, we only had Megan, but Josh is like a son to us now. And I know from the bottom of my heart that myself and your mother, we will always be there for y'all. You know that. Looks like y'all mean so much to me. I know choosing Megan has been the best decision Josh made in his life. <laughs> I don't know what's going on over there. Welcome to NOLA. about that day you know it, it just shows you that God was watching over me like he had a plan for me and it started back then oh my 
God, you're amazing. So this is it, huh? This is it.